Welcome back here to PlayOnSports.com and our man of the hour here, our player of the game, Tom Tavares. Only one touchdown, but the one touchdown that really changed the entire game. It was the double reverse play action wide open in the end zone. I was talking to head coach Dennis Gregovich about this, and you guys have been working about this all week. You executed tonight. <laughs> you know, what was going through your mind as that play was happening from start to finish? Well, when he had caught it, I just knew that I had to make a statement for myself, and I knew I had to make the play to get us just up, get us up more to win a homecoming game. You know, obviously a big night, and as you as you mentioned, a homecoming. Uh, you know, let's talk also. You know, mentioning that that minute thirty second, you know, complete one eighty turn. You know, up seventeen fourteen. All of a sudden, the defense makes two big stops, coughs up the ball. The the, the offense of uh, of the Tigers cough up the ball twice. You guys all of a sudden are up twenty three points. I mean. Yeah. I mean, really, just the emotions. What were the emotions, everything that was just building up in those final minute 30? I mean, what, what really just came about throughout, throughout that entire time? We just knew we had to stop them. We couldn't, we couldn't let, let it happen again. Like, they beat us 42-14 to 14 last year, and we just couldn't have it happen again. That's all that was going through our mind. Defense was just not letting, letting it happen. You know, talking about tonight, too, obviously, you know, last year you guys were the bottom dwellers, dwellers finishing 2-8 and eight, uh, uh, first thing to mention here, how does it feel to to be a part of the, the winning is already the winningest program in school history, but only in your seventh game? At six and one, you guys have never won more than five games <laughs> an entire season. I mean, how does it feel to be a part of just a remarkable team? Um, I'm just I'm just grateful to be be on the team. I'm just glad to be on the team. Um, we worked hard. We worked hard during the summer, we worked hard doing practices after school, everything, so we really deserve it. That's what I think. And definitely deserving too. And you know, coming off a season like that from last year, you know, going in, into this season, obviously, you know, still a lot more work to do. But really, you look at the rest of the schedule, and you know, obviously, you guys beat down the um, um, this team in San Jacinto pretty well. But they came in with a winning record coming in. The rest of the season, uh, still tough opponents. You have West Valley, uh, Citrus Hill, who's yeah. the top in your division, and also Beaumont, who really likes to beat down opponents. Yeah. You know, Gregovich mentioned that it's one game at a time, and you know, what's really the mindset as you guys go in down after down, game after game? I mean, what, what are you guys going going through as you guys go on the field and taking on these very resilient opponents? Uh, opponents. We're just hoping to um, we're just hoping to succeed in everything we do. But if anything happens, we we expect the worst. But you know, uh, you expect the worst. But <laughs> we just execute. That's all you do. We just execute. And you guys definitely did that tonight. A big win. Your second win of the year. Uh, still staying undefeated at 2-0. Once again, Tom DeVars, our player of the game here. Again, a big win over uh, over San Jacinto on a 17-point victory. I believe you have one more shout-out you want to make before Oh, yeah. Off. And to Lois in Ohio, Coach Gregovich said hi. <laughs> <laughs> I know you guys stay up there until 1, 2 in the morning to watch uh, this uh, Takowitz team play, and I know you're going to be celebrating out there in the Midwest. Once again, the final score, 37-20. The Titans over the Tigers. We'll see you back next week as they'll be on the road as they will take on West Valley. From all of us here, good night, and we'll see you back next Friday night.